hello my youtubers hello my facebook people how are you the people that i'm well pleased <laughs> in whom i am well pleased how are you doing today how was the day i hope your day is going well because mine is going well welcome to my channel today i'll be eating delicious food when i mean delicious i'll be eating <laughs> a bowl of soup with orishi orishi different kind of meat guys and also i'll be using fufu to eat it with i think let me double this i just feel like eating in my room guys i'm so tired i don't want to eat in the dining i want to use one stone to get to bed i want to be watching movie as well so that is it and i'll be eating it with fufu guys so come and join me guys i need you to come and join me yes come and join me let's demolish this food together so before we eat this food let's thank god for today father we thank you we honor you we give you all the praise for who you are we appreciate you for your loving kindness we thank you for your faithfulness thank you for your great provision thank you for this week you have ushered us into yes indeed all things are working together for our good because we love you as we eat this food this will be a healing to our body a blessing to our body and for those that believe in you lord for food oh lord trusting you oh lord for one thing or the other father i pray oh lord that our needs are be met in the name of jesus because you are the god that give us all things that pertain unto life and godliness thank you father thank you jesus thank you holy spirit for in jesus mighty name we pray amen hey key guys come and join me come and join me guys let's dig in let's dig in because i'm so hungry you know what's the time i think the time is almost to four i think it's early today but it is well yeah so guys do you know how i did i cook a uh, stew you know i told you i cook stew so i did this obolo without meat i just used fish to do the obolo then i used the stew <coughs> guys this is nice you can try this method and i use this stew tool i cook the, the stew very rich there's a lot of rich rich in the stew so all i just do is cook my bowl of plain then i have my stew there's one of our, our neighbor remember in nigeria this is how they cook even when they make a goosey soup, they'll make the goosey soup plain. They'll cook a pot of soup separately. And guys, this work for those in abroad because you don't need, if you want to eat rice, you can use your stew to eat the rice. If you want to eat soup too, you can eat and you can eat it will be it will enable you to change soup. Because sometimes you can do okra, you can do golo, you can do spinach. If you want vegetable soup, it's just for you to do the spinach, boil it. And had your stew, guys. Mm. Oh, take the first bite, Baba. Take in fact, take the third bite. Is it the third bite here? Yeah. But I know that God has already fed your home with goodies or food. So have, thank you. Hey, right, so they going, guys. How was Sunday? Did you go to church? Mm. Guys, Pastor Lodos with his word. Yesterday I was like overfeeding. Overfeeding of food, but overfeeding of the word of God. In fact, it makes me to know that God is with us. He reveals things to us. Because what pastor preached was what God revealed to me a long time ago. And when I knew that, hmm, my life has never been the same. Like I said, if you study the scripture and just understand one scripture, the, <laughs> your life will be transformed, guys. Pastor topic was just about the word of God, what the word of God does to us. What is salvation? What does salvation mean for a born again Christian? 
and he said it means everlasting life that will live remember the scripture always says for god so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son this uh, this was the scripture that god gave me a long time ago when we are growing up this is the scripture we start with you know we just read it but we didn't know what it means I didn't know what it meant until God opened my eyes, guys. <laughs> I will sneeze all the time. When I, in the morning, mostly especially in the morning, when I woke up in the morning, I will be sneezing, 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 sneezing. I will be fine during the day. But when I woke up that morning, I will be sneezing, sneezing, you know. <sighs> so I was praying about it. And God opened my eyes. Hey, God. God gave me John 3 16. I said, ah, ah, I read the scripture again. <laughs> what that scripture mean to us? If you are born again, if you have the life of Christ, that means you are you have everlasting life. You are free from sickness, you are free from disease, you are free from pain. Mali ha. Guys, when I go that scripture, hmm, my life transformed. So if I just see any symptom, <laughs> I just tell myself, no, this symptom is not today. You are imagining it. <laughs> because Christ in me is the hope of my glory. It's my everlasting life. I live through Christ. And the Holy Spirit starts to deal with me. Start teaching me the reason why you see <laughs> Yes, I know some people will say, ah, ah, but some people are dying. Yeah, it's only by your feet, guys. Remember Elisha? Elisha did not see that it was take. He was taken. Why Elisha? He will. He he suffered through sickness before he died. So, what people believe matters a lot. What you believe, that is what it will produce results for you. A pastor, people will say, Ah, pastor, pray for people, they don't pray for the boy, but that's if you saw the battle, what they believe their faith is for other people. Christianity is a race, it's all about what you believe. The reason why people die is because they believe in death, yeah. It's what you believe, guys. If you're solely by your belief, that is why you go to study your Bible. It's good to study your Bible because that's where you grow. Guys, this will be sweet one. Hmm. I have sick one more. Hmm. I'm going to start. There's chicken. Hmm. There's goat meat here. But this, this soup is so hot that I don't want to even try to touch the meat. Because the meat is so hot, so let me be eating the pandu. Grow with the word of God, guys. That is where you get to know who God is.
Guys, I'm not a dany person. Everybody is different. It's like I like eating. Sit down, just relax here or watch a movie. Mm -hmm. Well, I'm eating. That's how I enjoy the food. But you also that in the dining, not to watch. It just make me get tired of the food. I don't enjoy the food. I like it like this. Yeah, this is good. I want it for Arius. This is my love to him. Mm. Remember that this week, we are dispensers of God's blessing. All things are working together for you.
Mm. Guys, try this method. Cook a bowl of separate. Cook the bowl of separate. They mix two separate. Ah, you will love it. Mm. Right, you know how blow soup is now to follow you to drag. And I'm in public, I normally use fork to eat it. And I'm at all sometimes I use fork because I like using fork to eat so I'm, but if you do it here, yeah, people will read so many minutes to eat, you know. So I have to use my hand to let you know that I'm a real person. The only thing that is difficult for me to use my hand, I think it's rice. <laughs> I can't eat rice with my hands, I don't know why. This sweat is enjoyment sweat. <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm. Mm. Nah. If you're not subscribed to my channel, what are you waiting for? Please subscribe to my channel. Okay, I'll give you five seconds as I'm eating to do so. 
Okay. I'll give you five seconds, okay? Five, four, three, two, one. So I think I will play the video with the first one at five. I want to thank you for subscribing. God bless you. So subscribe to my channel god's hand will always be in your life subscribing to you channeling you or channeling you up for all good things okay this is the last one guys we did it hmm. Mm. Guys, thank you so much for joining me and for watching me, for viewing me. Everything you think, God will locate you this week in Jesus' name. Your heart desire will be meant in Jesus' name. And remember that it dispenses of God's blessing. Great things are happening with you today and great things are happening through you today in Jesus name have a great day bye